recording. Okay, so we are making mom's quick sofrito real quick. So far I have chopped. It doesn't have to be super fine or anything since it's all going in the blender. So it's one uh, green bell pepper, one red bell pepper because I don't like using the other, what is it, Aja, ajacito or something or the Cuban olives or whatever. I don't use that. So this is everything that we had here. And then I already have one onion. And then I'm going to chop like another medium onion. Pause. The one green pepper, one red pepper. Since the onions were big, I did one and a half onions. But if you have small, then do two Spanish medium size. And then one head of garlic. And I already put the head one head of um like a one bunch of cilantro in there and then we're just gonna stick everything in there and then grind it up they look tired huh i'm sleepy oh i think my chili's gonna start burning if i don't eat it all right pause it ready so we made a grave error why oh, is not out of focus so mom didn't tell us to uh Put the cilantro last. She did not tell us to do it last, so um, technical difficulties while I'm trying to like. Is it sure because it's the cilantro first? Or is the blade not, not spinning? Because I put it first. I'm supposed to put it last. But like the big chunky stuff supposed to go. You don't put bottom. no water in there? She didn't say no water? No. She just said toss the stuff in there <laughs> and blend it. Okay, hold on. Maybe she has to do this too, like stir stir. I've Jesus, never, Maddox I've scared me. I've never seen her do this. I don't see this thing. Okay. Now let's see if we can get this. Oh. No. Okay. <laughs> I don't think it's your blend. I, I think you're, I don't know. I don't want to say it's your blender. I just feel like, oh yeah, the cilantro is definitely stuck in the bottom. Okay. I should take that all out. No, I got it. Don't worry. Which one are you using to blend? Son of a bitch, all of them! Okay, pause the video. Use the dice. Just pause it. I am! All right. So I'm MacGyvering it. I took out the bottom, and now we're just gonna I took gonna out add the bottom. You couldn't grip it. <laughs> I helped, okay. So now we're just gonna put the rest of the stuff in the bottom, and hopefully that'll work. Did you have to put all that anyway? Yeah. But now it'll fit, since some of it did grind up a little bit. It's hard to be decisive. You want to just rinse that out real quick? Yeah. Okay. You got it in there tight? Tight enough. You tight? Okay. I mean, when you turn on the spinner, like, I'm pretty sure it tightens it anyways. It has to. Okay. Try this off. I said try the chop, the, the chop one first. There's like levels you gotta do with this. Shake it a little bit. Shake it that way you can get in the bottom there. I'm pretty sure there's something that mom didn't tell us. Does she even know how to make sofrito? <laughs> I mean, if she knows how to make it, why is she always buying it, or not buying it, but why are people always making her some and then giving it to her? <sighs> maybe it's the thing. The blender? Yeah, maybe the blender's just dead at this point. How old is the blender? Uh... It doesn't look that old. I saw that at the Walmart too. 
Yeah, but this one I got um, when I was trying to make smoothies to lose weight before I got pregnant with Maddox, so maybe about five years. You should have got what I got, the one that's freezing me. <laughs> the ninja. Right. Okay, let's use your ninja. We're gonna blend it little by little. Come on. We're gonna go use this 12 ouncer because it's our. It's okay, we're gonna put a little bit at a time and then we're gonna put it back in here. So, okay, so this is what, we're gonna scoop a few bunches of this and then stick it in here and then blend it. And then we're gonna like try and like move it around. Pressing. I'm gonna see if we're supposed to, I think there's something wrong telling not telling us either. I don't know, I looked at a lot of videos. And none of us say put a little bit of water? None. We're Spanish people, we don't put water in our base. Okay. Pause it, we're gonna scoop up it together. Okay. So I poured a little bit of that into that, and we're gonna do it a little bit out of time. Oh. Okay. Go. Okay, stop it. Alright, so then it has to be my blender. That shit worked pe like magically. Okay. Assuming that it's supposed to look like guacamole. No, not like that. Here, scoop it. Did you eat it? No. I mean, it was off to the side. I was just looking at it for a pause. That's gross. Okay. So we filled that up, and hopefully that's going to be our liquid and make this work. Okay. It's working now. Yay! Oops. Do I want a milkshake? Pure. Milk. The good news is at least it smells amazing, even though it may be the blender that isn't working properly because I probably need a new one. And that is how you make mom's sofrito. How do you stop it? You hit the pause. The pause to stop the video? Cause I'm done. Oh, you're done done? Yeah, I'm done oh, done. you hit the square. The, that square? Yeah. Okay. I also forgot to say, as since we ran out of, or not ran out, but since we don't have any of Grandma's Tupperware, i.e. the, the what is it, the Crocker, Crocker butter Tupperware things or something, Sorry. using the, you remember the uh, Grandma's Tupperware? Like the butter one? Yeah, the butter Tupperware. Yeah. So since we don't have any of those enough to fill this, we are using the next best thing with is a wonton soup from a Chinese restaurant that I saved to put, you know, my sofrito in and it's gonna go in the freezer. And at least it smells good, so you know, that's my base. Just gotta get a new blender.